A lot of anger is directed towards this picture. And we know why. Because when we learned our math facts, we learned to memorize them. So when we see 8 plus 5, we know it an the answer is 13. We memorized that a long time ago. What this question is trying to do is to show you why. People love adding things to 10. Adding 10 is easy. 10 plus 9 is 19. 10 plus 6 is 16. 10 plus 3 is 13. This doesn't require a lot of effort on our part because adding 10 is easy. It is convenient then to remember that 5 is just a 2 and a 3. Suddenly our question of 8 plus 5 turns into a plus 10 problem. 8 plus 2 is 10 plus another 3 gives us our answer. But more importantly, think about what this means for bigger numbers. I can add 98 plus 35. 8 plus 5 is 13. Put down the 3, carry a 1. 9 plus 1 is 10. 10 plus 3 is 13. And I get my answer of 133. But it is also convenient and easier to do in your head if you remember that a 35 is just a 2 and a 33, we're back to the same strategy we used earlier. A 98 plus 2 is 100. 100 plus 33 equals 133. We arrive at our answer more easily. So if you are angered by this strategy of learning addition, Know that students are just learning why addition works. But rest assured that if you prefer doing your addition this way, students will still learn the standard algorithm. It's about understanding why and having a choice.